Dwayne Bacon is already putting in work this summer as he looks to come back better than ever next season. In this edition of Buzz City Beat, we look at three coaches the Charlotte Hornets are set to meet with Jeremy Lamb's career season and Netta Ramosina declining to comment on rumors linking him to the Queen City team. Hornets to interview three HC candidates, Adrian Wojnarowski, San Antonio Spurs assistant Ime Udoka will interview for the Charlotte Hornets coaching vacancy this week, league sources told ESPN. Spurs assistant Edda Ray Messina and former Memphis Grizzlies coach David Fisdale are also set to interview for the Hornets job in the coming days, league sources told ESPN, it looks like Charlotte has identified the top candidates for their vacant head coaching position. Fisdale is considered the frontrunner but Messina and Udoka have also entered the running for the job. Udoka is a surprise name that has popped up most recently. Aside from meeting with the Hornets, David is also set to meet with the New York Knicks and the Phoenix Suns. As for Messina and Udoka, neither have been linked to other teams around the league but both are highly regarded and respected. Ime is considered one of the top head coaching prospects. The 40-year-old Udoka has played 316 games in the NBA, including four with the Lakers, linked to Mitch Kupchak in 2003-04, and has been with on Greg Popovich's staff since. 2012, Jeremy Lamb's career year, CBSSports.com, Lamb enjoyed the best season of his six-year career as he scored a personal high 1,033 total points, which marks the first time he's reached the 1,000-point plateau. The former Yukon Husky also dished out a career-high 2.3 assists per game. Before this season, the closest Lamb got to scoring 1,000 points in a single campaign was in 2013-14 when he reached 665 total points with the Oklahoma City Thunder. Not only did he set a career high in scoring but Jeremy also achieved career high marks in assists, steals, blocks, minutes played, field goals made, threes made and free throws made. The 25-year-old really took his game to the next level as he was the sixth man for Charlotte. He is expected to have an even bigger role next season as he enters the final year of his contract. The Hornets will have to make a tough decision on whether or not to re-sign Lamb. And if they aren't going to bring him back, will they look to trade him? Making only $7 million per year now, Jeremy is expected to receive a big payday when he hits free agency if he keeps up his current form and growth. Messina declines to comment on Charlotte rumors, MySanAntonio.com, I don't think it's the right thing to make any comments about that rumor, Messina said in his post-game media session Thursday night after the Spurs 110-97 loss to Golden State in Game 3 of their first-round playoff series. Ettore seems like a consummate professional. He is not going to comment on his future endeavors while still with his current team. San Antonio is having a rough go in the playoffs so far as they are down 0-3 to the reigning NBA champions in the Golden State Warriors and are without their star player in Kawhi Leonard. Messina filled in for Greg Popovich as the team's head coach during Game 3 and is expected to do the same in Game 4 after the passing of Popovich's wife Erin. Once the Spurs are eliminated from postseason play, Ettore is set to interview with the Charlotte Hornets.